has arrived. <laughs> How are you, man? Oh, wow. Not bad. Not bad. This is sick, man. <laughs> so, Chad Borba just towed down my first ever wake surf boat, and it's a Mastercraft. I'm super stoked. It's an XT22, so he's going to walk us through all the functions, how to run this thing properly, how to set it up, how to maximize the wave so we can be shredding behind it all summer long. Uh, it only took about six, seven, maybe 12 beers for us to come creatively to this decision of the white and black. Uh, my favorite part, the only Mastercraft offers is the teak swim deck. Okay. So Chad's gonna run us through all the functions, how to set this thing up so we can be shredding all summer long. It's gonna be awesome. Oh my, this thing is prime time. Let me tell you, tan and white looking all right. Mastercraft. <laughs> so clean, the white looks so clean, yeah. dude. It really is, man. It's timeless. You guys crushed it. It has that new boat smell, too. Oh, we need that right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. We just made it. Yeah, we Woo! bought some beer. We got the Mastercraft cooler over here, matching with the boat. This thing is prime time. <laughs> Nice job, man. Heck yeah. Okay. Hey, nice boat, buddy! Off the team! Thank you! <laughs> GoPro mounts at the back, and so you can pair your GoPro so the driver can record everything. No so, you know, if you want to go, hey, I want to surf right, you just hit what you want to do, and the boat does it. Like, you, do you have to uh, set the settings? No, nope, it does them? it all. So, once you type that, hey, I'm left or right, it does it, and then if you go, hey, I'm steep or mellow. But for the profile, do you have to set your profile how you want it? Nope, it does it all for you. Yeah, so like, say, awesome service, like, ah, I don't know, let's make it you know let's mellow it out a little you can just go to whatever setting you want to go to on the fly and the boat will adjust and the other thing too is lifting up actually makes it steep it's counterintuitive you would think drop it down and it's gonna make it bigger actually lifting it up will make it steeper okay so let me I'm gonna go down there and then I'm gonna turn around so now that he's on left those yep. three tabs that pull up will the far right one be zero correct yes okay More speed. So now we're starting to wash out. That's pretty good. Yeah. So why do you get first dibs? I don't know. It's like, you know, Austin just trusts me with these kind of things. You know, it's like I need to dial in this wake for him, and he needs to dial it in for me. So what we're doing today is we're just doing a little R and D, a little research and development. If you know what I mean. That was good, man. Looks good when we got deep water, but unfortunately the lagoon is tide dependent. So we're working with these deep spots in the lagoon and we got a kind of a low high tide today. And it's not even high tide. All right, let's take her for a rip. Now, if you do better than me, it's obviously because of the tide, not because of the skill, okay? So where's it at now? All right, let's try that. Thank you. 
right, that's it. Here we are. Chad Borba brought down the boat. I can't believe I got my own wake surf boat now. This is amazing. Uh, we got to test out the wave. Depth was a little iffy, but uh, that's just Carl's Bad Lagoon. But this thing is sick. We're super stoked on the colors that Reed and I put together and couldn't be any more stoked on just like the whole interior, the exterior, just the way the wave is just it's a freaking awesome boat. So special thanks to Mastercraft, my sponsor, Chad Borba for bringing it down. I can't wait to be shredding all the content we're gonna make on this thing. I'm just tired of talking about it. Let's just make some more videos. Let's go. Outro, Outro and we out.